I'm here to talk about saving a file in Office 365 or Office 16, a little bit different than the earlier versions, such as 2010. I have the spreadsheet created. At the top here, it says it's book two. We need to name it, put it where it belongs. You can put it in several locations. I'm going to do the control S to save. First thing here, if you go into OneDrive, that is in the cloud. You need to have an Outlook or a Hotmail account. It'll go into there. This is showing folders since I work with my personal computer of different places I can put it. If I click on Browse, this allows me to go into different aid things here, like an external drive, my USB drive. And if I click on Libraries, it's going to show Documents. I could create a folder by clicking on new folder. I will do this as a quick example and I could just say Acme Enterprises. Open it up. It says book two here. I would give it a name. However, let's say I want to put this actually on my flash drive. It says USB here. I do have a folder that was created called Excel. Um, I don't know if I needed a different folder here, let's say new folder, I could go into Acme Enterprises, double click on it, and then I could say Acme Order Form. It is going onto the flash drive now. You see it right there. So that has been done. Let's say you've done something where you've revised things. Like, let's say I just made this text bold and in a color. This is the new one, and let's say there's some new prices here. 22.28. This one went down to 13.95. And what I want to do here, I want to call it alternate order form. You don't do file save because you want to keep the original one. File, save as. It's going to remember the folder you were in. It shows it here. And I could say Acme updated. I could click inside there or type over it. Updated order form. So it has a new name. Next thing here, I want to show you a really cool trick here. A lot of times when I'm doing things here, I don't like poking around. I'm going to go back into my folder. Uh, it show, this is the flash drive here. I go into Acme. Let's say I've got to do an estimating form. I'm in the folder. All I do is right click inside this panel here. I left click on new, scroll down, it's not alphabetical. I go to Excel worksheet at the bottom. And I could just say Acme estimate form. Open it up and I could do my thing here. Acme estimate form. Type in all the numbers that I need to. I could save and exit from this. Click on the X. We're done. It shows the three things here. Other cool thing, this is a Windows type of thing here. Uh, this started with Windows 7. If I click on the item here, you see I'm getting a preview here. And what it is... When I'm on the View tab, I have the Navigation pane here, the Details pane. That shows the details. I'm going to click on View again, Preview pane. This gives you a preview. Great way to know what you're looking at. Some places may have restrictions in their network where you cannot do that.